Hi, everybody. Hey, uh, thanks for your involvement in uh, AP Statistics for this quarter. Um, I can't express how much I would prefer to be in person with you as we tackle the challenges of this AP class. However, our circumstances remote learning, and I appreciate your efforts to make the most of it. I also thank you for your patience as I navigate this unprecedented change to the job that I've done for about 30 years, and I've loved for about 30 years. Soon, if not already, you may be wondering and be concerned about what more challenges second quarter and AP statistics may bring for you. My hope is that for the first quarter, we can get close to five chapters completed. There are about 12 chapters total that we'll need to cover. We're on pace uh, to do that be, with us beginning chapter three on Monday. Here's what I envision for second quarter. Knowing that you have second quarter class requirements and those are your priority. Here's a few things I want you to keep in mind. Number one, there's not gonna be any new curriculum in AP statistics covered in second quarter. It, it would make sense for me to try to move on while you're trying to navigate your second quarter classes. There will be weekly optional Zoom meetings. Optional Zoom meetings will be scheduled for review of first quarter material. And that's what it's gonna be designed for is review of first quarter material. No work will be formally assigned for outside of those Zoom meetings. We're not gonna to go to that meeting and say, hey, I want you guys to do this for the next time we meet. We're not gonna do that. I don't wanna to add to your workload. Also, additional Zoom meetings may be created upon student requests. I would, at, I would ask that at least two students be present and your parents or guardians know that you're doing those meetings because they're gonna be extra meetings. And if you're interested in going deeper into the topic, you can. This is an opportunity for deepening uh, your understanding of first quarter concepts and pave the way for third quarter material, but your priority is your second quarter classes. For third quarter, looking at further ahead, and the main purpose of me making this video was to talk about what's going to take place in second quarter, but for third quarter, we're going to cover chapters 6 through 10 with a brief and topical coverage of chapters 11 and 12. We have to do 12 chapters total again, if you remember. Um, fourth quarter, those not taking the AP exam have finished the course. Congratulations. Uh, and I sincerely mean that. It sounded like I was being sarcastic. I wasn't. Those that are taking the AP exam will have a path created for them to sufficiently cover the remaining topics in deeper detail. The hope is to minimally affect your fourth quarter classes as much as possible, but you are taking the AP exam and I want you to have all the tools that you need to be successful on that. Um, this is all subject to change, right? Based on the type of instruction the virus is allowing us to have, be patient, be confident, and I'll work hard to get you, get you to where you need to be in this class. Um, thanks for listening to me. Um, I can go over this stuff again in the future. If you have questions, I can answer that. But again, remember, it's all subject to change, right? What I need and what I've gotten from uh, a good portion of my AP stat students is really good engagement and a, an attempt to, to cover a lot of challenging material. And I applaud you for that. Um, I'm honored to be your teacher. Stay healthy, keep in touch, and I'll talk to you guys later.